better summer destination in Chicago than a table outdoors. Alfresco dining is at a premium, and tonight we introduce you to three new hot spots in tonight's Your Chicago. Across the city, as soon as the temperatures take off, a table outdoors becomes prime real estate. You know, we want to absorb every ounce second moment of summer possible. From downtown to the West Loop. Great atmosphere and great food. To Streeterville, there are great new hot places to enjoy al fresco dining. Well, we call this officially the, the Chicago Cultural Mile. Right across from the Art Institute, Alpana Singh's new Seven Lions offers a 70-seat patio, burgers, salads, and a great atmosphere next to all the city's cultural offerings. This is what it really means to be in the city. I mean, to be outside, experience the city, watching people walk you know, by and sort of hearing the sounds and you know, just, just sort of being part of that, enjoying a nice meal. <laughs> Another great option is located in the West Loop, about a block off trendy Randolph Street. It's called Parla Pizza Bar. It offers a whole lot more than just pizza. First and foremost, it's about location. You gotta have a good location. Michael Bisbee is proud of the world-class pizza, salads, and general great vibe that Parlo Pizza Bar offers with two separate outdoor dining options. I think it's great. Food's great. The atmosphere is great. And then there's Streeterville Social. Well, Kate, as you can see, we are in the heart of the city. Lowe's Hotel River. CEO Jonathan right Tish is proud of the city's newest outdoor space and the largest at 10,000 square feet. It's going to be a place where you can come after work, have a small bite, have a sandwich, have a Streeterville Mai Tai, which is our signature drink, and be able to really enjoy yourself. With stunning views and plenty of room, Streeterville Social is poised to become a must-visit destination. It's a few weeks that we can use this kind of space. Hopefully it'll last well into the fall, even though you might need a sweater in October. But Chicagoans, they're tough. They can handle that. Great point. For more information on the locations that we mentioned tonight, you can head to CBSChicago.com. And if you have an idea for your Chicago, you can tweet me at KSullivanCBS2 or Rob Johnson at RobJohnsonCBS2. Well, what a way to end the work week and begin the holiday.